Hello and welcome to our video on the legendary Twitter sensation, Pakalu Papito. You may have known him as Xavier, but who is he really? And why do so many people love Pakalu Papito while others express hate towards Xavier? In this video, we'll uncover the mystery and explore the phenomenon behind this internet sensation. In 2013, Pakalu Papito burst onto the scene with his first tweet that simply read, Hello Twitter, I'm single. Over the next two years, the tweet gained over 17,000 retweets and 6,000 favorites, while the account gathered upwards of 739,000 followers. He quickly became one of the most popular Twitter accounts on the platform, with his unique style of humor and witty one-liners. What made Pakalu Papito's tweets so funny? It was his ability to take the mundane aspects of everyday life and turn them into hilarious jokes. He created puns about everything from Indian culture to his deep, single-life depression. People all over the world fell in love with his unique brand of humor, and before long he had amassed over 700,000 Twitter followers. He had a way of making fun of everyday situations that we've all experienced in one way or another. For example, he would tweet about the struggles of waking up early in the morning or the frustrations of trying to find something to wear for a night out. But he would always add his own unique twist that would leave people laughing and sharing his tweets with their friends. Another aspect of Pakalu Papito's humor was his ability to make fun of himself. He would often joke about his own flaws and insecurities, which made him more endearing to his followers. His self-deprecating humor made people feel like they were not alone in their own struggles and made them appreciate him even more. But who is the man behind the Pakalu Papito persona? While there are many rumors and speculation out there, the truth is that the creator of the character remains unknown. The person behind the Twitter account has claimed to be working in an IT firm in Minneapolis, Minnesota, but their identity has never been officially confirmed. Interestingly, the profile picture used for Pakalu Papito's account is actually a picture of a man from India. I do not want to disclose his name. Some sources claim that he works in the physics department at IIT, located in the northern part of India. If you don't know, IIT stands for Indian Institute of Technology, which is the most reputed university in India. If it's true that he works there, he is not just a normal meme character, but also a highly educated and intelligent individual. Someone scrapped this from IIT's website and posted it on Twitter. It was in 2019, and it mentioned he is a teaching assistant. However, as per new website picture, he is promoted as senior tech superintendent. He was able to create a unique brand of humor that resonated with people all over the world. It's no wonder that he was able to amass such a large following on Twitter. In 2015, Pakalu Papito had around 800k Twitter followers and 500k Facebook page followers. Sadly, in 2018, both his original accounts were taken down by Twitter and Facebook, but the screenshots of his tweets were already trending by then. Though it was rather unclear on the reason why the two social media accounts were taken down. Since then, many anonymous users have created Twitter and Facebook accounts using his name and posting funny tweets, and the username Xavier is one of them. Xavier's account has also amassed a large following and has been able to create a similar brand of humor that resonates with many people. While some fans of Pakalu Papito criticize Xavier's content for copying other internet comedians and lacking originality, others enjoy his content and find it funny. The jokes are often recycled versions of jokes that have already been shared by other popular comedians. According to Pakalu Papito fans, Xavier's attempts to copy Pakalu Papito's gimmick have been widely seen as a cheap imitation, lacking the humor and charm that made Pakalu Papito a viral sensation. Pakalu Papito's jokes were based on his personal experiences and observations, while Xavier's jokes often seemed to be lifted straight out of the comment sections of other popular comedy content. The creation of the subreddit r Xavier is a clear indication of the resentment that many people feel towards the Xavier character. Xavier's content may not have the same level of authenticity and originality that made Pakalu Papito so popular, but it has still found its own audience and continues to create content that many people enjoy. In the end, Pakalu Papito's legacy lives on, even if his social media accounts have been taken down. While we may never know the true identity of the man behind the account, we can all appreciate the laughter and joy he brought to millions of people around the world. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video on Pakalu Papito.